Hello everyone, welcome to this video. My name is Max. So, I've just finished um, formatting my hard drive. It's a 235 gig hard drive or 256 gig hard drive. So, what I want to do now is I want to install Linux Mint 20.03 onto this hard drive. So, this is a um, this is my actual system. This is not a virtual machine. So I thought I'd make this video showing you guys how to install Linux Mint. You've probably seen them all over the internet. This is just one more. So before we start, I just wanted you guys to see what hardware I'm dealing with here. So this is going to be installed on a Latitude 5400, which is a Dell Latitude 5400. Uh, so these are my hardware specs. So let's go ahead and begin with the install. So right over here is the bootable CD. So you can either double click on it with the left mouse button or with the right mouse button you can right click on it and then left click on open. It, either way it'll take you to the same place. And this is the installer. And so First you go ahead and choose your language and then click on continue. And then next you choose your keyboard layout. For me, mine is going to be English US. Then you click on continue. Well, before you click on continue, if you want to test to make sure that your keyboard is compatible with this version, you can always just run through and test them real quick. That's good enough for me, so we're just going to go ahead and click continue. And then right here, you want to choose install media codec so that you can play different media on your uh, Linux uh, computer. And then you click continue. All right, and then you have a choice. You can choose to erase your whole hard drive, or you can go to advanced features and then choose something else. But for us, I'm just going to go ahead and choose to erase the whole hard drive and install Linux Mint on it. And so I'm just going to go ahead and click install now. This is a brief summary of what it's going to install on your hard drive or on my hard drive. And then I'm just going to go ahead and click continue. All right. And then you choose what area you are closest to. For me, I'm on the eastern uh, seaboard of America. And so New York is going to be what I need to choose. And then I'm just going to click on continue. And then in here, you just go ahead and put in your uh, information. What's the name going to be? And that's going to be my name. And then I'm going to choose my password. And then I'm going to confirm my password. All right. And then you just go ahead and click on continue. All right, and then from there, everything else is just going to be automatically installed. It's going to go ahead and install the uh, Linux Mint software for me, our operating system, and then it's going to uh, put it on my hard drive, and then after that's done, I'm just going to reboot the system, and I'm going to go ahead and use it. So... Let's see, I don't think we'll make you wait to see the whole thing. That's it. Everything else from here is going to be pretty um, pretty straightforward. You should be able to figure it out uh, if you want to install Linux Mint on your own system. So, that'll be the end of this video. Thank you very much. I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Thank you for watching this video. It will be posted in both YouTube and Facebook. Please like and subscribe. Bye-bye.